Jensen Buchanan is an American actress whose career began when she played Sarah Gordon on One Life to Live until 1990, followed by a series of films like Another World, and in 2015 she joined the soap The Young and the Restless, playing Elise Moxley. Jensen's Sentence to Prison Jensen's career was progressing quite well, and she was a legend in the world of soap operas until 2016, when one mistake led to the end of her entire acting career, as well as her promising feature on television. The soap star Butchanin was sentenced to one year in county jail and given five years in probation for driving under the influence with a blood alcohol content level of 0.34 when she reportedly veered onto the wrong side of Highway 154, colliding head-on with another driver and nearly killing him. Bradley Asolas, who was the crash victim, reportedly sustained massive injuries, including a ruptured spleen, shattered pelvis, lacerations in his liver, a collapsed lung, pulmonary embolism, and a possibility of his knee never recovering. Buchanan was, however, released after having served about a month and a half of custody time, and that was just but the peak of her path to downfall. Buchanan back in court After being convicted and serving that short period where she was released on probation, Jensen had some rules to follow, and this included wearing an ankle monitor to detect her blood alcohol level and it reported that between December 2017 and January 2018, hers had risen to 0.18, which was a violation and she was back in court again. Buchanan's lawyers went to her defense, highlighting her compliance with the probation conditions. But she was sent back to jail and bail was not allowed until a new hearing was held again. And on the 6th of April 2018, Judge James Voicey declared that there was no violation, so Buchanan was released from jail and put back on probation.